कैसे हो भाई लोगों यहाँ पे बेड़ा गरक एकदम बेड़ा तड़क गया लेडीज एंड जेंटमैन व्हाट आर वीक इट हैज बीन हाउ माय टॉक्स एंड गेमर्स आर डूइंग टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू बी टॉकिंग अबाउट गेमिंग टुडे बिकॉज़ गेमिंग जस्ट डस नॉट स्टॉप आई मीन लेडीज एंड जेंटमैन वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द वर्ल्ड रिंग गेम प्ले लीग द गेम प्ले डेमो गॉट लीक्ड आउट वी गॉट ब्रांड न्यू कॉल ऑफ ड्यूटी गेम्स गेटिंग लीक्ड आउट नॉट वन बट टू कॉल ऑफ ड्यूटी गेम्स ये टू कॉल ऑफ ड्यूटी गेम्स इफ यू कुडंट इवन कंप्यूट दैट दैट हैपेंड ये टू न्यू कॉल ऑफ ड्यूटी गेम्स वी आल्सो गॉट GTA 6 न्यूज़ एज़ वेल देयर इज अ टन टू गो ओवर देयर इज अ वीडियो दैट आई वांट टू शो यू एज़ वेल लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब इफ यू आर ब्रांड न्यू एंड इफ यू डू नॉट एंजॉय यू कैन ऑलवेज चेंज इट इनटू अ डिसलाइक यू फील आई एम सेइंग बट गाइस बेस्ड ऑन द लेटेस्ट रूमर्स द कॉल ऑफ ड्यूटी स्केड्यूल लुक लाइक दिस ओके वी आर गोइंग टू बी गेटिंग कॉल ऑफ ड्यूटी 2024 दिस इज गोइंग टू बी मेड बाय ट्रैक एंड ट्रैक आई गेस वी ट्रस्ट राइट stop the cat maybe a little bit maybe just a little bit maybe, maybe we just trust a little bit okay so that's happening call of duty 2025 this is going to be a sequel to black ops 2 and it's going to be said in 2030 i mean damn ladies and gentlemen why what are we talking here if you if you suggest thought that like you know call of duty is ever going to have a two year life cycle well gone are those days okay that it's done so man they're going to be having bbc bundles in this like out here two new call of duty's <laughs> two new games are confirmed but i have to say the leaks are looking very very Bruh. good right they're looking very very good let's be real i mean modern War modern warfare 3 turned out to be really really bad i mean there's suckers that are saying the multiplayer gameplay is actually pretty good uh maybe that's true maybe that's not how how would i know because i actually skipped this year right so that happened then we have the next story we're hearing that over 23000 accounts have been banned in call of duty for cheating since mid november <laughs> and you know for the fact that these are going to be 23000 uh, new people that are going to be signing up let's be real and this story guys everybody sit down for this story okay like everybody gather around okay y'all sick has got to sit down for this one okay so lapses gta 6 hackers sentenced to life in hospital prison. Oh shit. Oh, yeah, shit. that happened. We had news BBC reported. I'm actually talking about BBC this time, the British broadcasting channel. We come on guys, we're not talking about like that BBC from the A A A A A A A A A A A A A Friendly you every lie. I don't have the filter. <laughs> I I don't have that filter right now cuz I'm actually running on my laptop setup because my PC broke down so you know just wait a little bit I'll do that friendly UAV online real real voice but this happened and this is absolutely insanity right insanity right because this sucker okay, just leaked the Lucia Bonda bro So what people got to see the gameplay that's exactly what everybody's saying right now or at least 90% of the people are saying I want to know your thoughts on it you know Sega's are saying life for an 18 year old boy who leaked a video game this cannot be seen <laughs> oh, okay maybe 5 years right 5 years 10 years okay 15 years life entire life in prison in or i should say hospital prison that is absolute in insanity man and there are people saying that bro really he gets life while people that purchase and played with uh cannot say these words on youtube you know the island situation right they don't even get a fine but this boy uh, you, you know he just for leaking the lucia burna but you know it it's deeper than what meets the eye cuz obviously i can sit here you, you can like sit there and listen and you can also talk with your friends right now and talk about this and say that yeah he got jailed for only leaking gts his gameplay i mean obviously like that he leaked the Lu lucia burna and i don't think he should be jailed for that long okay 5 10 years understandable and at one point we're hearing that this second was going to be on bail but he absolutely flopped all of his chances oh, shit. he oh, killed shit. all of his chances for for getting a bail because every time you know they try to speak with him that hey bro like are you going to be good like when you go out there kid be nice okay and every time they asked him to stop leaking he continuously said that i will leak i will leak i will leak i will leak i will hack more companies more companies and more companies and this is exactly why he, his ass is not chained up and it's truly sad to see because dog like you could have actually played dumb uh you could have just said that okay i'm not going to leak and when you you know they have your ass out maybe then you can try i mean i'm not saying that you should i'm not like saying that i'm not with the hackers here okay i'm not i'm just trying to say just trying to make sense of this that dog you ruined your entire life over this situation had you just said i won't leak it 
let me be free, they would have let you free. Because in the beginning, they actually deemed him and they're still saying this kid is autistic. Uh, they're saying like he's not mentally fit. But he ruined all of his chances. So that happened. And there are suckers that are passing around the Wolverine demo gameplay as well. Uh, if you guys do not know, yeah, the entire Wolverine playable demo is out. Oh shit! Oh, yeah, shit. it is out. I know in the very beginning, like Sega's did not want it to believe, but apparently Sega's are passing the download link for that. Like it was some Tic Tacs. Uh, like we used to, how we used to pass Tic Tacs in public bathroom. And obviously, like for two people out there, I know most of you guys are Giga Chad. Most of you guys are uh, probably not gonna download this thing. I mean, seriously, okay. I'm obviously I'm joking around, but. On a real note though, guys, don't download, okay? Bruh. I know some of you are like, Skizzle, you just downloaded and you're saying that I should not download, guys. No, 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 I'm not downloading Squash, okay? I, I don't care for it, don't care for it, and don't Bruh. care for it, okay? And, and simply put this, if you're somebody that is intrigued by it, there are multiple reasons why you should not download this. A, you do not even know if this is a real download or not, right? Even if it's real, dog it probably got 20 tons of malware it's not like once you download this and you're gonna be getting all that get all that bunda all, all the, the the gameplay for wolverine no 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 it's not that guys if you get the ransomware attack you are done so okay especially if you got like credit card information or if you ever stored your or you logged in on your like bank account or uh, any any important stuff like government websites right if you ever signed it ever heard of government websites if you ever done that and you signed up on or logged in on those websites there's something called cookies that are constantly and they are forever stored on your pc i know there are some some people gonna say you can technically remove it yeah there are ways but you think that the general pop uh, population is that smart to actually remove all of them? Come on, man. So definitely don't do it. And you guys, check this video out. Roll it. What's up, gamers? Dreamcast guy here, talking today about the PlayStation hack because they have finally responded to all these massive details getting posted on the internet. It's been almost a week now since yeah. Sony's servers have been breached Damn. and a bunch of hackers managed to steal two terabytes of top Bruh. secret stuff. Bruh. Wolverine. Leak the alien files, bro. Like, why y'all leaking two terabytes of this? I love the gameplay leak as well. Leak another uh, GTA 6 gameplay. Or, obviously, I'm joking around, exaggerating. I wouldn't mind if they actually leaked it, though. Uh, I'm not saying that they should leak it, but guys, just think about this, man. This, uh, this second, or whoever this group is, right, that hacked Insomnia games, y'all second could, could, y'all second could have leaked the alien files, though. You know, people deserve to know the truth. And, and for Sony here, real quick, what are we paying you for right now? What are we actually paying for? Why, why are we paying for online? If you're constantly gonna get your ass leaked and hacked though. As a brown man, I demand free online. Like and subscribe if you agree. Gameplay, employee details, mocap footage, just super secret contracts about their next games going forward a decade. It has been a catastrophe for PlayStation, but until now, they've been keeping their lips sealed. So let's take a look at what Insomniac has said about the stolen data and what I feel like is kind of going unsaid. Okay. Let's get into it. Hi, Hi. if you're having if a you're good having day, a be sure I'm to- I'm not having a good day right now. I'm not having a good day, bro. <laughs> like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. But, but, but like and subscribe, guys. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays, uh, happy new year to my homies. Uh, I, I, and if you're a Pakistani, Hindi, or uh, Indian, or if you speak Urdu, yeah, gan kujao bati bajao, okay? Gan kujao bati bajao. Ready? So it's over here on Twitter. They just posted this, and I, I want to say right up front, the love towards Insomniac is very well earned. If you actually scroll down here, literally every single reply is overwhelmingly positive. This is the oh, best damn. studio at PlayStation. We love you, Insomniac. We stand with you, Insomniac. <laughs> Have a nice day. Sorry to say, like literally, literally every single. And, and this is spawning like a ton of like Xbox fanboys, uh, PlayStation fanboys, and there are a lot of conspiracies and a lot of controversies going around uh, about like the Xbox tax as well. If you ever heard that word. I mean, like, it's bull squash, right? But the Xbox fanboys believe it. And, and like, a couple of days ago, I mean, there was also, like, PlayStation tag situation that was also trending, and that was spawned in by the PlayStation fanboys. And, I mean, fanboy, I listen. Listen, man, I love the memes, I love the sauce, I love the salt. Keep on bringing that in. But at the end of the day, it's like, damn, bro. And for those people that don't understand Xbox tags, uh, just to make it simple, uh, people that 
are claiming xbox tech all the all xbox techs all they mean is like unfair advantage you know you, the, because playstation is always gonna stay on top and there's no way for xbox to catch up that's what's called xbox techs and uh with the game awards because last year you know or for the last few years like only games that win are like the the playstation Bruh. games they, they constantly win the awards and sega's xbox fanboys and sega's are like okay that's the xbox takes she starfield didn't win an award starfield didn't win an award that means xbox tech so there's a whole lot of bull squash happening like that and surely this spawned in, as a, a spawned in a lot of other conspiracies and a lot of controversies because there is also kind of funny podcast those of you that are that have heard about it you know what i'm talking about right because they previously have you know leaked uh, or talked about the leaks about the suicide squad game uh, a long time ago they also talked about the capcom hack that was similar to insomnia games but i'm not sure that's what like the word is around the streets i don't know about anything about the capcom hack but stickers are saying that yep that happened and kind of funny games were talking about it and this time it's, they are saying they're not gonna talk about the insomniac games hack <laughs> Uh, not surely like we're, we're nobody and no yeah in, in like in terms of gamers and in terms of like real and good people nobody's talking about the actual employee information and that sucks right like the employee information got leaked out their passport scans got leaked out a ton of their private information credit card information and uh, a ton of the employees are already saying that there are identity thefts happening their credit cards are being stolen they have to call in request for a new one or close down so yeah a lot of that weird stuff is happening their bbc got leaked their bwc got Bruh. leaked right like a lot of that stuff we really are living in that cyberpunk reality my guy so there's a ton of crap like that is uh, that, uh, is happening which definitely sucks for sure why is pure freaking love and it's well deserved insomniac is the most well reliable playstation studio right now they make back-to-back -back bangers ratchet and clank the marvel games their own projects i mean they kick butt so this breach has been substantial. And, so, and sadly now their butt got kicked as well. Which is... Let me take a look at what they said. They just posted this a couple minutes ago. Already it has 40,000 likes, which is completely bonkers to think about. Oh shit! Yo, can a brother get two likes? Thank you for the outpouring compassion and unwavering support. It's deeply appreciated. We are both saddened and angered about the recent criminal cyber attack on our studio and Damn. the emotional toll it's taken on our dev team. We have focused inwardly for the last several days to support each other. Now, mm. something I've seen a lot of people talking about that, is that this- Yeah, so now they have officially confirmed it as well because I know there have been some suckers that have been saying that it's not real, it's not real. Meanwhile, their actual gameplay leaking out. And you know, this is still an ongoing leak and ongoing hack because they leak like about like, uh, 1.7 terabytes of data and you have to actually assume that a lot of it is still uh, you know suckers are still digging it up they're like still shoveling it okay they're still shoveling it they're still trying to find like diamonds from the rug i know the xbox fanboys were like yeah yeah, yeah. it's not the diamonds bro it's it just the crap they're trying to yeah i get it okay i get it man i get it okay so that's happening and it's still an ongoing hack this is by far one or, or not one i would say the biggest gaming hack to date the gta 6 hack was the biggest in terms of like popularity uh, and it was the biggest uh for the time when it leaked out because yeah sure we didn't know anything about it, or we knew we had the leaks but you know it wasn't concrete or you know circus would have never believed the leaks and it, it, in fact even to this day after ha we have seen the gta6 trailer i still see comments people saying gta6 is a fake game it's never coming it's a fake game but these comments used to be very much like alive we used to see these comments on literally all the gta6 videos and understandably because you know we had leaks we had rumors and how many of those turned out to be fake how many of those turned out to be real i mean a lot of them turned out to be real as well but a lot of them were fake as well and over the year you know it, it's like a different topic altogether that happened but with gta6 leak we only had the gameplay leak this time we had the gameplay leak the playboy demo got leaked out as well uh employees information their bbc bwc passports all that crap and their 10 years plan got leaked out uh, leaked out as well and god knows what else is uh, in the files there's uh i believe like contractual agreements with disney marvel uh, uh, maybe not disney or maybe i'm not sure about that but there's a lot of words a lot of leaks thrown around on the internet thank you right for now. your ongoing support during this challenging time now, this is another part I've seen some people kind of talking about, which is that 
It feels like they're kind of implying that people were concerned the game would be canceled. Insomniac confirmed that the game is not canceled. I don't know why oh people think God. it would. And they're showing real official footage when the time is right. Damn. I'm extremely excited whenever we see Wolverine. I'll be honest, I've been on social media. Uh, the leaks have been all over the place. I have not purposely sought out the leaked gameplay, but uh, cab stop the cap. I've seen quite a bit of it. And I'll be honest, it looks <laughs> <laughs> okay, he did not sat on, but he seen. Oh, that makes sense. Makes sense. Makes sense. Incredible. Even pre pre alpha, this game is like pretty much texture boxes and combat models at this point. The game looks like it's going to be insanely good when it comes out. Here. The Xbox fanboys would disagree, but I have seen the gameplay and I have seen like a lot of people like uh, say that it's looking crap. A lot of people are saying the game doesn't look that good. And listen, man, the game is going to be coming out in three years from now. It's still an early development. Just the, And I know, like, I, guess, uh, I said the same with GTA 6 as well when we had the Lucia Bruna getting leaked. <laughs> When the Lucia Bruna got leaked out, people say, it is fat, it is fat, but the gameplay sucks, bruh, the gameplay is looking trash, bruh, and now that we have seen the gameplay, and everybody's like, okay, well, it looks good, man, like, I'm ready to buy it, even if it's $100, I'm gonna pre-order it, there are sickers that are saying that, and saying that, and it's a brown man, I demand free online for PlayStation and Xbox. <laughs> Both of them, though. No Xbox fanboy crap, no PlayStation fanboy crap here. I demand free online. As a brown man, as a gamer, I demand free online. Like and subscribe if you I I agree. And a lot of people are calling this uh, Wolverine demo to be crap, and it's three years away. 2026, I mean, damn, bro. Kill me now, bro. What, three years? God, it it's so weird how long games take to make now. But I wanted to actually yeah. highlight something interesting. So this is the Director of Community and Marketing at Insomniac. And I get a feeling that this guy, James Stevenson is probably the person who wrote this statement oh, or, you know, uh, approved it at the very least. And it's interesting that he highlights their terminology because clearly it was carefully picked. Stolen data, not leaked info. Criminal hackers, not leakers. Pirated build, not leaked demos. Now, I think it's interesting that they're really specifying this because some of the leaks are uh, actually criminal in nature. Um, you can technically download a playable version of okay, that, 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 uh, ding, 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 ding. Uh, okay, that part is kind of true, right? Um, and I understand, okay, this is James Stevenson. I believe he's the director. He works at Insomnia Games. I'm not sure his actual credentials. So from for him to say that, I understand, especially when their employees information and all that crap leaked out. Uh, it, it's like one of those things, right? Yeah, we can all sit here and we can all like talk crap and make fun and whatnot. We're, we're not doing that. I guess nobody's really. Uh, yeah, some people are, but most people are not doing that. We're just memeing. We're just making lighthearted jokes and jabs. And that's exactly what I'm doing here. But I understand, like, for example, right? If I, if I were to put myself in their shoes, I, I guess I would be pissed as well. You, you would be pissed as well if your BBC got leaked out, your BWC. I, I know I'm like throwing these terms like loosely <laughs> just to make like an entertaining video or to kind of like, you, you feel what I'm saying, right? Like a lot of, yeah, you guys understand, right? Like it's just for the entertainment. But on a real though, I want to get this message across that it is not okay. I am cool with the gameplay leaks. I want to make it very clear. I don't mind the gameplay leaks. In fact, I get hyped. I, I love the gameplay leaks, right? Right? I know a lot of you love it, a lot of you don't as well, which is perfectly fine, we can agree and disagree, uh, it's perfectly fine, but for, for, for a dev to come out or for the director to come out and say this, I understand, uh, especially when their information got leaked out, and playable demo, or you know, pirated builds, that's what he's saying, Bruh. but in our, you know, gamer language, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a gameplay demo, right? It's a gameplay Green, demo. And some people have been doing it, uh, apparently though, as soon as you do it, you get a letter from your internet service provider provider threatening to shut off your internet. This stuff is technically oh, oh, super yeah. illegal corporate code. It's not stuff you're supposed to even be able to see or access. So uh, downloading it is, is literally illegal. So I think it's interesting they're saying this isn't a leaked demo. This is a pirated build. Now, Damn. I think it is wild that this even happened in the first place. The, the amount of stuff they managed to do. How many times like leaks happen for PlayStation? How many times hacks are happening? I, I know like the original 2011 PlayStation hack that happened and, and I, I was like okay right now i'm like 27 uh and we are in 2023 right 2024 almost 27 27 ding da, 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 e, 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 12 years uh back right 15 and then 
Uh, I think it was 50, 15. Yeah, 15. Uh, 14 or 15 when it happened and Black Ops 1 came out. I remember like the DLC for Ascension Zombies came out. That happened. But, uh, and it was a one month long hack. Oh shit! Oh, shit. I, I've been through that! I've been through that! This is something that I will tell my kids, my grandkids about that I lived through the era of the PlayStation 3 hack. And after a month, we ended up getting like free games, so that was actually very, very nice. We had the PlayStation credit. <laughs> credit i don't mind hacks like that i don't mind leaks like that where we get free games but then we had like the other leaks which i obviously not remembering but you know jumping to the last of us 2 leak that happened uh this happened gta 6 happened not playstation but but you know what i mean right how many times though and as a brown man i'm just demanding for free online for playstation like if you agree and guys click on this video on the screen this is by far the most insane story of them all Phil Spencer is actually removing it. Click on this video on the screen. On the left though, we have PlayStation and Xbox fanboys going absolutely crazy. They have a huge meltdown. Check out both of these videos and I will see you right